what if today was the day when you finally let go of everything that has been holding you back for so long now it could be the pain the regret the memories or the person or probably the job opportunity that you missed out on it could be anything it's been a long time now i've been trying to convince a person to let go of a person and move on in life and it's been very difficult for me and i have absolutely zero idea how to tell them that it's your life only you are the person you are responsible for your own misery you are responsible for your own happiness and nobody else owes anything to you it's your responsibility your life is your responsibility nobody gives a damn if you are happy or you are sad nobody cares about you so your happiness is your priority let go of people and memories and all those things that are holding you back i was not convinced that i would create such a video but after looking at the situations of people and even after realizing that years ago i was in the same phase i was in the same situation and how did i cope up with that was it that easy it's not easier for anyone i bet and honestly when you are in the very beginning and you are just facing it in the very beginning and you are facing it for the very first time it's exceedingly difficult for you because you have no idea like what is happening because you thought that everyone is like me if i text people in just one minute they would also do the same but they just started ghosting you see don't trust people because people will change and don't rely too much on people because you never know what they think and how they are going to behave people will keep changing and you need to be able to okay with this fact that yeah they will change and i'm fine with that because i have also changed for the better moving on is and should be a part of your life i don't know it should be difficult i know it it must be very difficult because you might be having memories from years ago you might be having a lot of you know moments together that you are missing out on now you are you are looking at the pictures and you are missing things but when you realize that they are not the same person anymore then how come you are supposed to be the same person if a person tells you once that they no, don't need you you don't have to let them tell you the second time if they ghost you once ghost them forever block them see my funda is simple i get back to them as soon as i can i get back to every single person but if you tell me once that you don't need me or i'm not as important as i give you the importance in your in your life i will deal with you the same way i'm not going to be chasing you because see we are all alone in this journey and we are not here forever if you're not here forever you need not you know pressurize yourself to follow certain people or to follow some nuances or to follow some notions that are created by society that you need to stick to these four friends otherwise you will never get people trust me you will get far better people i have tried it and it has always worked for me every time i thought that oh my school best friends oh we are not together anymore we don't talk anymore and we don't even get to meet but then i met so many wonderful people that i don't even regret that you will never be able to meet more people you will never be able to move forward in life if you don't let go of people and don't move on in your life whether it is the job opportunity or it is with people just move on the endless what ifs the endless situations the endless stories going on in your head and you are overthinking all the while just let go of everything because letting go of all those things will just you know unburden you you are carrying a lot of burden on your shoulders and you don't even deserve you don't even need to carry all that burden nobody has asked you why are you stick with those memories when you should be moving forward in your life you are a beautiful person and you are young and you are wild you are free and you are free to do anything in life just let go of those people you are in a miserable shape because you are not joining gym you are in a miserable shape because you are not doing your skin care you are not hydrating yourself you are not exercising enough you are not working out you are not going out with friends you are not chilling you are not doing any 
Diwali party or you're not going out to celebrate or to attend concerts or to meet new people or not even in the park, just nearby a house. You're not doing these small tasks on daily basis. Then how come you are expecting people to come to you and talk to you when you are not taking care of yourself? See, you always attract who you are. You don't attract you know, better or wonderful. You just attract who you are. If you are a wonderful person, you will always attract wonderful people around you. So your topmost priority should be you. It is not any other person. It is not some other person or their, you know, thoughts or their behavior. It's just you. Always remember this one thing. When you make yourself the priority, nobody can take that what is yours. It is yours. It is your time. You are not going to live here forever. Nobody is going to be here forever. So when you have this time, don't spend it on people who don't even deserve it. Nobody deserves your time if they are not giving you the time. You're, they are not reciprocating your love, your affection, your time, your energy, your investment. If they are not reciprocating it, you don't have to give it to them. I hate to say it like this, but look at yourself. Go and look at yourself in the mirror. What have you made of yourself? Are you the same girl, the same giggly person, the same, you know, boy that you used to be in your childhood? Are you the same person anymore? Look at your childhood photographs. Are you the same person? You are miserable because of your own misery. Nobody is responsible for your misery except for you. If you decide today that I am going to unburden myself and I'm not going to run after people who have take, already taken a lot of my time and energy, I still think, to be honest, I still regret spending my time for people who didn't deserve it. I wish I had done some workout or I wish I had written some poems during that time. So, it's absolutely not necessary to chase people even if you have had years together. Probably they decided to move on and you should take out your journal, write down, write down the version of yourself that you want to become the version of yourself who has let go of everything and now you're free you have unburdened yourself you are doing all those things that you always wanted to do you're loved write about everything that you imagine yourself to be then spend 24 hours without thinking about past without thinking about any person memory or regret or guilt or any moment of despair that makes you sad or that makes you overthink your possibilities or your opportunities in life. So, spend 24 hours with yourself and don't overthink at all. Don't think about the what ifs of life. Just spend 24 hours with yourself doing things that you really want to do. Go some, do some rock climbing or you can go do some yoga or any session that you want to take there are so many community clubs these days just go out and have fun and just immerse yourself into music poetry art or anything that you want you are miserable because you are responsible for it see we have a quote in hindi that says khali dimag shaitan ka ghar hota hai. so when you have nothing to do you start overthinking about your decisions in life so whenever you have time you start doing these things we always do these things when we are free. When you're busy, when you keep yourself busy, when you keep enjoying your life, you don't have time to think about all these things, to you know worry about all these things. You are actually very busy doing things that you really want to do. Go do some rock climbing, go do some ice skating, or if you really want to spend some day with you at your home, make coffee for yourself, watch Netflix, eat, watch Netflix, do some yoga, listen to some good uplifting music if you want i can suggest you that and be happy if you are very busy in your life living your life nobody can take that away from you only you are responsible because you are not letting those memories go if you let go and if you move on nothing can stop you and see it was all your energy it was your inner self it was it was your investment all the while if you take that away from that person that person is nothing just a human human being with the flesh of human being they are nothing it was your energy it was your miracle it was your magic all the while 
you have invested so much of your energy into that potential person who was not that potential who did not have that potential and capacity and now it's time to take that energy back just hold it to yourself and give it all that to yourself just sprinkle it like that now you have taken all your energy and they have nothing they have absolutely nothing with them they are miserable without you so keep that to yourself and if it's a job opportunity that that is making you feel like that let go of that if you don't let go of that you won't be able to welcome something and it is a recent incident with me and i know better let go of that previous job opportunity you will get far better opportunities all you need to do is you need to work on yourself if you keep grieving about the things that happened in the past you won't be able to focus on the present and the future that was it in today's video and i hope that wasn't too long but uh, to confess what i really wanted to it had to be long i didn't expect myself to create this video but i had to eventually because i was not able to confess it clearly i was not able to tell people why they need to move on and why they are not able to move on you don't need another distraction to move on you just need yourself all the while you just need to accept it very gracefully and you need to say to yourself that it wasn't meant to be and something is on the way and that is something that i really deserve and that is far better than what the what i had in my past that is all you need that is the mindset that you need i'll see you in the next video till then take care of yourself and keep hydrating yourself bye